Hello everyone, I'm Mr. Mocha Lover, and thank you for joining me here, of course, in Hearts of Iron Fork, Heiser Reich, playing as that good old German Empire. Last time, we made some pretty major advances, I would say, on Tominsk, and as well as Petrograd. <coughs> Excuse me. I had to sneeze. Oh, well, we're doing really, really well. We're pretty darn well. Oh, an encirclement. But let's hopefully keep it up in this episode. Uh, just come up that way, guys. Actually, uh, yeah, just come up that way. You just gonna hang out for now. Cut him off. Oh, the cipher is done for the Russians, you say? We, of course, might need to readjust our line. So we might consider doing that first. And I'll go all the way down to like there-ish. Good, 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 good. Uh oh. <coughs> Excuse me. My apologies. I don't know why I'm sneezing so much. Woo! So, a comment from yesterday saying sometimes my voice is still a little distorted. Um, the audio fades in and out. Uh, I'm not really sure about that, to be honest with you. Really not sure. It might be YouTube, because when I checked the, the raw video file before I upload it to YouTube, it seemed pretty normal. But, you know, I'll double check. I'll double check once this is over with. Cool. So, we lost a plane, so be it. Uh, the French are still not attacking for some reason, which, if they're not going to attack, I still need to get heavy tanks. We're getting some armored cars, but I also maybe try an naval invasion of France from behind their lines. But really, the focus is very heavily on taking out the Russians. That is my first goal. Oh, we got to keep an eye on manpower as well. We are on extensive conscription. All right. European exchange program. Currently, we're building up more refineries and a couple more roads, which is always nice to have. Do we need any equipment? Some fighters. We definitely need some fighters and maybe some more guns. Let's do that. There you go. Sure, yeah, I'll take some Avia Falkers. That sounds really nice to use. Do these divisions have. I think I said this yesterday. They do not have logistic companies. Do I even have them researched yet? That is a good question. No, I don't. That's the first thing I'm going to research in this episode. Logistic companies. Because fighting in Russia, you're going to need logistic companies. You're going to need them. In some places. Uh-oh. Nice. We lost a screen for four enemy screens. Not bad. Pretty good. Alright. Excavate you three. Very nice. And let's grab sub of this. Oh, right. My apologies, guys. I had to go blow my nose up. Oh, my goodness. We're going to need a lot of guns now. That is not good. That's not good. Yeah. Wow. Jesus Christ. We made more divisions. Um... I guess for now, just from on the Russian front, go ahead and put this to low. Because I really don't want to have a lot of resistance and stuff like that happening. Oh, uh oh. Yeah, go ahead and retreat, guys. Go ahead and retreat. You're doing a great job. Just go ahead and retreat. Uh oh. Plane. Plane, that's fine. Whatever. Plane, 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 plane. So let's spend some time making a few more thousand pieces of guns. We're doing really well in artillery, actually. I thought we were doing pretty darn well already on artillery. Up north is pretty bad. Around here. Take half, you guys. Come up there. That'd be fine. Anywhere else? Uh, you guys could probably come that way. Smash them. Go that way. That'd be good. Give our guys just a little bit more time. Lilith, uh, you know what? Just go ahead. You already have enough planning bonus for now. Let's get a cypher going. This will be the end of the North Russian Front. Good. Very nice. Ooh, 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 come on. Good, get up there as fast as you can. Yeah, I shouldn't be attacking when we have a gun deficit, but we'll be doing okay. We'll do okay with this. Support equipment is looking very nice. I just don't want to put anything in here yet. Or raise some of the levels of our guys. Uh, because supply is super bad. 
on the eastern front. But maybe on the western front, we can change some of our divisions here. You guys are big boys. Select all. Can I make some big boys out of you? No, we just need more equipment. For these guys, what are they? They're just gunners. What if we went with artillery? We'll gain... Oh, no. That's not artillery one. Mit artillery. Thank you. Awesome. That's good. That's good. Operation. Oh, prepare a collaboration government. Good. Can you repeat that? No, we can't. That's okay. What's over here? Oh, oh. Lost the convoy. Retreat. Nice. So we probably don't need this many guys to do that. What they're doing over there. You guys come over there. And then you... You're a linguist, so spend some time in Russia. That's a nice place to be sometimes. Sometimes. Oh, nice. Looks like another dead piece of land. Good, good, good. Death set's coming online a little better now. Let's see. U12. Make sure you got enough of this. We'll use up more artillery and support equipment, which is totally fine with us. Totally fine. You guys... Are you big boys? Actually, what type are these guys? Oh, what? You're all what? Oh, you might... Are you with the artillery already? No? No, they already are. That's good. This costs a little bit more manpower, maybe. Maybe not. I don't know. Let's see what happens. You guys, U13 divisions are pretty awesome. And these other divisions are... Need work. We will gain a lot of manpower back, which is good. Most of you guys are going to be good. You, uh, you have the tank on you. I don't really like that. Just instead of a tank, you'll do that, which is fine. Whatever. Cool. And we've sunk another convoy. Great. Pull out, pull out. Ludwig, uh, are you going to upgrade yourself sometime soon, maybe? Uh, first, I thought they only had like three subs. There you go. It's torpedoes, reveal chance, screen penetration. Let's go with the reveal chance just because... Just because you can pierce their screens doesn't mean you're actually going to kill anything. And I want less reveal chance for everything. So I think that might be better. Oh, we lost another sub. I need, I need to consolidate these subs into a larger group. Stop doing that. Go and go repair because we are left with 10 subs. We started with way more. But, uh, yeah. Oh, you know what? Keep going, guys. You're doing a great job. Oh, we'll cut their supplies off, which really hurts them hard. Oh, I love it. And we have, potentially, some armored vehicles. Good, so we're getting some logistic companies. I could really do some artillery stuff, but I need some tanks. To break through into France, we're going to need some heavy tanks. <clears throat> Alright, excuse me guys, sorry I had to blow my nose once again. I don't know why I had to keep blowing it, whatever. But this is looking kind of weird. It's kind of a weird uh, three-piece flag we got here. We got the Germans in the north, of course, and some Swedes and some Portuguese. And we have the Polish, Lithuanian Commonwealth, and the Kingdom of Ukraine. I don't know what this piece is going to look like. But hopefully, it'll be very good for us. I, if I could, I might want to write, like reward the Polish, Lithuanian Commonwealth, and the Ukraine. I think they deserve some piece of extra territories and privileges. Just because they've done very well with us. Very, very well. Cavalry. Ooh, our deficit's almost done, which is awesome, awesome, awesome. You say more military factories? I say okay. Plop, plop. Cool, cool. Alright. Alright. Any... Oh, hello. Do we have a surplus of steel now? That's good. Surplus of tungsten? Good. More factories for us. We have a surplus of rubber too. Look at that. I love the rubber. Uh, for now, don't let them raise their autonomy. Get it from the Princely Federation, which should be good enough. Any more fuel from anyone? Oh, Bulgaria, why? I still don't mind trading more fuel for people from people. Fuel? We're never done building refineries. Never done. Uh, go and do that. And they canceled their lendings because I have a, sur a huge surplus on infantry equipment now. Nice. Interwar armored cars are definitely what we could use for garrisons. Because that saves on manpower as well. Very good, very good. And the war in the north is doing really well. The south obviously needs a little bit more help. Especially right here, but... These guys are pushing so darn well, it's not even funny. Alright, let's go ahead and spread this out a little bit more. Alright, actually... Where are you, 13? You guys are going to finish up first. I want you guys... 
to get like here. Spread yourselves out even further south. Because I don't... I think the Russians at this point are pretty much beaten. They lost quite a few guys. What is that? A hand? 50% collaboration in the Russian Empire. Good. 50% compliance when the enemy capitulates. Nice. Can I do some more of that, maybe? No, we need more... It's time for our spies to get some collaboration going. Good. Oh, look, some tanks. We can cancel the lend lease, so be it. Whatever. No one cares. Africa section. Very cool, very cool. Come on, guys. Try to hit me more. Nice. Couple more enemy screens hit and dead. Oh, and Canada's trying to fight Mexico. Wow. Canada's trying to fight the PS... This USAS. USAS. And they're struggling. Have they, they have lost a, lost a little portion of New York. They have entered Pennsylvania a little bit. Unless Pennsylvania is already part of the New England area, which I doubt it was. Maybe I'm wrong. I thought it was already part of the CSA. Oh, they've got New York City back from the uh, C CSA. Ah, oh, so many S's, so many C's. Oh, too much for me. Cool. Alright, guys, reorganize yourselves so that you're appropriately placed where you need to be. And just finish these guys off so we can move up. How many divisions does Russia have? Less than 100, holy crud. That's really not good. Not gonna lie. Von Rundstedt has done a great job. Heinz? Good, good, good. European exchange program, good. Let's see, grain and steel would be cool. New weapons? Sure. While the German army has the greatest soldiers in the world, it must not lag behind in equipment terms. Even the greatest of soldiers will have a hard time defeating a better equipped army, an enemy, and it would not be or do for the preemptive world power to have troops armed with broomsticks. Yes. Armed with broomsticks, not a good idea. Really not a good idea. And we'll get a little bit more excavation. Very good, very good, very good. Awesome. We have enough rubber for now. I think we can wait on that. We definitely need better artillery. Holy cow. Completely forgot about that. Guns are great, artillery is great, motorized is really great as well. Alright guys, if you can get down there, please get down there. Sounds like we're getting navally invaded, so be it. Give our guys some time for more planning speed. Where are we getting invaded? The Bismarck Sea, maybe? Oh, we're trying to find some Russian ships around here, eh? Go, carriers, go! Spot those bastards! Rolf, do a great job. You've done a great job thus far. Maybe some more. Oh, we need better radar, too. Ooh. That'll help us spot stuff in the seas. Are you guys repairing or just kind of hanging out? Docked, docked, docked. Oh, wait. Oh, this is another screen. Another ship. Another fleet. I'll throw you right there. Even though I don't have the supplies for it, that's okay. All you guys, combine. And there you go. Now, I know I don't have the fuel for it, so I'm not going to let them, like, actually do stuff yet. So we got to wait for them to do stuff. Oh, cool. Except for the common France is done, too. Very nice. Another cipher? Oh, uh, Union of Britain probably would be pretty darn good to do. Alright, supplies looking quite a bit better here. Let's see. Can I make you big boys? Yes, we've got enough equipment now. Conken buff. Hagen. Let's see, you motorized boys. We have enough of these guys, so I don't feel too bad about doing this. Artillery. Artillery, artillery, artillery. Motorized infiltration, yes, yes. Good. Very nice. Less armor, but whatever. Uh, motorized recon, sure. Engineers, support artillery, good. These are the speedy infantry boys. Very nice, very nice. Let time go on. They're trying to bomb the hell out of our ships, which means we need more fighters, but I, don't, I need more fighters. Where do we get fighters? Fighters, there you are. I mean, I'm ready to make more tanks, but I just don't have them researched yet. I know, quite unfortunate. Quite unfortunate. You can lower that by five to make more planes for now. We need more rubber, too. Oof. Oh, boy. Good. Three things on our refineries. I always want at least three things, three lines on refineries right now. Alright, we're ready to go. I think we're ready to go. Especially the center line, especially since we moved a lot of our soldiers further down south. We can smash more of the normal Russian army. 
Alright, pretty good. Pretty good. You guys are doing great. You can get Kursk. That'd be awesome. Refineries, great. The fall of Moscow. The situation in the Russian Empire appears dire indeed. 43. I think it's a more production efficiency cap. That sounds nice to me. Even though we probably need to get better planes too as well. Look at that. Just, mmm, love it. Get one guy up there. You know what? You guys come here. Cut him off. If we could cut off at least one division here, that'd be great. We are moving in here. Oh, and then they showed up. Cutting it. That's disappointing. Come on, guys. Move those chubby little legs. Well, at least we cut off three divisions. That's all right. Nice. Very awesome. Hopefully the Swedes will get more land out of this. I don't really know how the peace deal is going to work. It looks like we got some enough manpower now, or political power to get more manpower. Let's see. I want to wait just a little bit longer to do that, because I might shuffle some divisions around and delete some armies just to get a little bit of manpower back so we can use them. We've lost a total of 1.68 million, which isn't bad compared to the Russians, 2 million. And we're fighting the Japanese a little bit, but then we're also fighting the Third International. Kind of, even though they don't really atta like attacking me. Prince, Prince von Bayern, very cool. Anyone have upgrades? Wilhelm, no. Hermann Hoth. Gorilla Fighter, Trishman Speed. Hmm. Are we lacking anything? Fighters, still more fighters. So be it. Better artillery, oh, there goes the Dominion of India. Oh boy. Get even better artillery, hit him even harder than before. Wow, the Bharatiya economy is looking pretty darn good. They're probably going to win the Indian Civil War. China is pretty quiet, pretty quiet now. And America is still raging on. They've been invaded by the French Republic. They can't invade their own home country, but they can invade Florida. And the South in general, wow. Actually, who's leading the, uh, this group? Oh, Foster. I was expecting Browder. Trade Union Unity League. American Commissars, that always sounds good. Increased automobile production, the Rebel Girl, Industrial Juggernaut, leading the revolution. Very good. Alright, we shot down a plane, that's good. Yeah, just... I think the Russians are done for. Yeah. They have... Well, that's still an okay-ish number of divisions. Oh, Georgia's in the alliance too, I forgot. I didn't realize that. Do we have ability to do... This? No. We're still researching those logistic companies. Seven days, five days, four days, how many days? I don't know. Certain number of days. Yaroslav will be ours. We have Petrograd. We have Moscow. We need, was it, Tsaritsyn? Oh, but still a ways off. Tsaritsyn. Wow, uh, Swedes, I, I might recommend you pull off, pull out maybe a little bit more. For you guys, I recommend just going back to this theater up here. Come on, hang out in this theater. Don't worry about supply. We've got now an extra army to watch things, which is good. A couple more divisions. Uh, throw them around there if we need to. Now, like, so we only need, really need two more uh, divisions for that army. So give me two more guys. So we can fix up that guy. Oh, actually, maybe three more. There you go. Whatever. Never mind. Cool. And just get better logistic companies now. Yeah, we need two divisions. That's fine. Or change stuff around. Maybe make some more later on. Something like that. And with artillery, get logistic companies. Actually, you don't even have a recon on you guys. We have enough motorized that we should probably be able to do this pretty well. The big boys, of course, needed to logistics. Thank you. Good, good, good. Support companies doing okay. Let's change this to motorized recon. Even better recon. Oh, we have... There you go. You guys come right there. This would be great. Awesome. Very nice, very nice. We're doing pretty darn well, not gonna lie. Let's see what they have. What until do we have on Vladimir the Third? A third of a million map, or 400,000 map, or they did raise their conscription level to extensive conscription. For a while, they were on limited conscription. 
uh, probably around 100, maybe 90 divisions. They have Alexander, and then they have Alexander, <laughs> double Alexander. So they got a little bit of a fleet, a little bit of a fleet. The West Indies Federation has capitulated. Oh, who did they capitulate to? Mexico? Oh yeah, maybe Mexico. All right, well, whatever. We're struggling in Pennsylvania a little bit. Oh, Ukraine, my friends. All right, so we can get more of this from them. Great infiltration assault is awesome. Even less supply consumption now. That's really good. More land out attack. Very good, very good. Let's grab a little more manpower now. I hate doing this, but service bar requirement is what we need right now. And we're done building military factories and refineries, but not really. But really, not really. Even more. Right now, we get a daily gain of 9.3 thousand, and it is still not enough. Never enough. The Navy needs so much fuel. Uh, let's see. I'm going to put another one right there as well. Let's hope with the rubber as well, which is great. And then plop one more right there and there. Military factories for all. Manpower for all, too. New weapons. Great. We have this. This war on two fronts is pretty good for defense and organization, not going to lie. All right, I don't want to just spam infantry to attack here, though. I definitely need those tanks done. And 66 days, a few months, that'd be fine. Up, oh, and we're out of manpower. That's not ideal. New weapons, good. If you need to, just lower that one too. New weapons. PEK1. Grain and steel. Finish the 1934 plan. Hmm. An independent Luftwaffe. Keep the Fliegertruppe. Strategic bombers, long range bombers, Singapore. Airborne stuff, ex air experience. Ooh, that's pretty good. I like that. Cultivate aviation seems pretty good. Air doctrine research. Yeah, an independent Luftwaffe is probably the way we're going to go. Factories, factories. Oh, that's not bad. Economic boom. I want the economic boom. So, pay EK Eins. Black Monday has hit the civilian industry horribly, and the military industry has been affected even worse. Our military supply specialists are clamoring for a program with, for the extension of war relevant industries or a program for the. Erweiterung Kriegswichtiger Industrien to ensure our military has bullets to fight. God, I hope we got bullets to fight because we're currently in the middle of a war. And we got enough manpower for now, which is very nice. Ah, oh, Franz, you have an upgrade. Oh, you become a health fighter? Awesome. Awesome, 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 awesome. Actually, I should probably use a cipher again for these guys, but whatever. Doesn't really matter. Oh, we're doing it again 300 days, decrypting. Whatever. Uh, let's see. Can you do machine assisted encryption? That might be good. Come on. So they are about 69% of the way there. Nice. Nice. Very nice. Alright, with that in mind. 22 divisions. They just shoot with guns. They need more. Artillery? Yes. Hit them harder. With more artillery. Actually, how's their planning? Some are doing okay. Go ahead. I want to say stop. But we're doing pretty darn well. You know what? Go ahead and stop. Everyone, cross the entire line. Now we can do the entire front line. And then we'll have one mammoth push. As I put in more divisions, or upgrade these divisions, to have better stats. Oh, 18 combat with That's not going to cut it, man. You know. Allies, please stop. Please stop attacking. With artillery. We will be... Oh, we will be out of artillery. Time to ramp up more artillery production then. Let's see, Federation, you can't give me any. So be it. Burma, you've got the job. That is okay. We're getting more military factories as well. We are going to lower the amount of guns that we need again. Because 27,000 is a pretty good amount of stockpile. Next up... We need more tungsten. Let's grab one more from Burma. Good. I want one more blast. One more massive and front-wide push against the Russians, and that might just crack them. Uh, actually, we already kind of cracked them a little bit. Oh, is that too much? Cool. It's fine, whatever. More research. Even more artillery. Hit them harder when we get it. Good. We're still using some divisions here. Yeah, a lot of templates. We still have a lot of templates here. 
What are these guys up to? Grand Army Reforms? I mean, if you wanted to go to war, you should have done that. Like, you should have done more stuff earlier. They're still in volunteer only. Holy cow. Now we're going to start really focusing on our air power. Once the Russians are done, air is going to be there. So, a number of com companies have decided they're going to invest in Egypt, which has begun a program to modernize the country. As such, those companies are seeing slightly better profits, and this has started to trickle back to Germany. Great! A whole minus 1%. I didn't know we were investing in, um... Egypt, in the middle of a war. Oh, we were defeated by a small little contingency there. Alright, well, whatever. And we still the front down here, too. I'm not trying to naval invasions around there. Uh-oh. Obvious? Oh, yeah, probably planes. I could really use more planes. Oh, uh, Albania. Sure. Sure, go buddies. Sure. I do not want to attack until we got more artillery. Give me just like... How much more planning do we need? We don't need some... We don't need more planning for some of these guys. So, we get a plan... Preparation increases by 2.2% each day. Plan preparation attack bonus 6%. Max 48%. We just need to wait a little bit longer. Great. We got another military factory. That's always awesome and welcome. Let us grab P.E.K. Zwei, the program for the Erweiterungs, Erweiterung Kriegswischer Industrie. I can't say I can't speak German that well today. Or abbreviated P K I P E K L or I. That's I. But who would want to abbreviate such a good German word? Is making progress. At least our arsenals don't have to open their last reserves whenever a unit wants to move out anymore. There's still some way to go, but at least we're on the right path. We get a whole another military factory. Happy 1942, my friends. Happy 1942. We want to make one more last push. Before the end of January, though. Hmm. Even partial planning is still good than better than nothing. Oh, they ended their hostilities. Very cool, very cool. Alright, give us just a little bit more time. Dominion of India was, of course, annexed. Just get us a little bit more planning bonus. And then we're going to try an one more front-wide attack. Because we still have... The a war on two fronts, national spirit, until the end, close to the end, of uh, February. So I want at least one more good month. Now this might not do well for a push now, but we you know what, whatever. Some years will do really well. Go ahead, see what happens. Go ahead and see what happens. You might be able to do here well here. You might not be able to. An entire front-wide strike. Oh boy, what's going on? They're really trying to bomb the hell out of our navy. Alright, how many divisions does Russia have? They have less than 100 still. Good. Can we see how much of a stockpile they have? They've got quite a few armored cars, quite plenty of artillery and infantry equipment, of course. Okay. Okay, so they're, they're not really giving up anytime soon. Excessive conscription. 400,000 manpower. Alright, not bad for them, not bad. It is February, so it is what it is. Operations. Plant civilian administration, infiltrate Air force, fair collaboration, government, yes, please. Please repeat when necessary. Please re resume mission when you're done. Uh, that's fine, natural order. Any meal. Good, good, good. Oh, nice. Convoy sunk. Three planes were shut down, whatever, whatever. Come on, guys, do something here. Still no fuel. We get 9.1 thousand a day. Not bad, not bad. We are slowly advancing in the center, which is actually, I would say, probably pretty good. That's pretty good. In the north, supply is such an issue that we're really not being able to move anywhere that we really want to. So be it, you know. Supply is terrible. If I could help them out with supply up here, that'd be great. Maybe Yaroslavl, perhaps, as well. If I own these territories, I could probably help them out as well. Go ahead and stop doing crazy attacks. Do that. Russians are definitely not done yet. Definitely not done. But we've made really, really good gains in some areas here. Help them out, help them out. Just push them back. Actually, if you could push that this way, cut them off, that'd be much better. Nice. Very nice. Any more industries we could throw on? Planes? Defense? Speed? Oh, uh, sure. Fighters, we want to help the fighters out as much as, we, as much as we possibly can. Up and they're down there now. Great. Hmm. 
couple divisions down there looking like they have problems. War on two fronts is over, unfortunately. Oh, by mid February, that's not good. 123 days, I'm doing it anyways. Doesn't really matter. Oh, Tsaritan is pretty darn close. Pretty darn close. Closer than I thought. Uh, we're going to do a cipher for Russia again. Oh, there it is. Good. Alright, so we got to wait a little bit more, a little bit longer, so that we can get, reorganize ourselves a little bit better. That's fine, that's fine, you know what? Let the Russians build themselves up a little bit more and they'll come smashing in there. That's fine, whatever. And if that's the case, I'm just going to go ahead and manually smash them in areas where I think they'd be good to smash. Von Kleist? Infantry expert, yes. Starts and will be ours, though. Nice. And let's grab economic boom. With our economic policies following the Black Monday widely regarded as a resounding success, private investors have picked up on the lead, and the economy has not only stabilized, but is currently experiencing a boom of sorts. It won't hold forever, but for the minute, we can at least concentrate on, press, on other pressing issues. For a year, we get more output, basically. And more factories to use. Great. That's not enough refineries. Move you up to the top. All right, we have a single tank division here that's holding out against us. So be it. Yeah. Going to, like, having the AI do, like, frontal attacks, I mean, it's okay. It's not great. Yeah, don't attack over there, over there, guy. You guys do that, you'll probably do okay. Yep, you'll do fine. All right. Ooh. I spy potential encirclement. <clears throat> don't mind if I do. Cancel only, so be it. Are we missing anything but planes? Artillery? Just a wee bit. Just a wee bit. Good. A few less Russian divisions is the better for us. Come on, come on, get in there. Great. Look how many more divisions we'll have to, we'll have to guard the front line than sort of, instead of having to do this. Muy bueno. Alright, anything down here? Yes. Ah, uh, very nice. Attacking armor like that is not a good idea. Really not a good idea. Oh, now we can make some tanks. That'd be nice. That'd be really, really nice. Could I probe myself into there? Maybe. It is 1942, so... Better guns? Let's get this first. No more focus on light tanks. We have over 4,600 light tanks in reserve. Uh, heavy tanks is where it's at right now. Make them really reliable. Oh, maybe more armor? Nah, I'll do that. More engine. Looking good. Tiger tanks. Great. Um... Alright, let's do this. Oh, the Fall of Chicago. Great, perhaps the war will be over soon. Nice. Actually, go ahead and duplicate that and then do heavies. Good. Now let's replace all those with heavy tanks. Alright, alright. Tons and tons and tons of heavy tanks. And we don't have the army XP for that. That's okay. Just gonna make some old we'll take stuff out when we need to. That'd be okay. Okay, we don't even have the fuel for it right now, so it doesn't even matter. Hey, look! An encirclement! Better logistics, too! Awesome! Nugget Logistics 3. Because we still have some supply issues in some areas, like... Right, Russia! Like Russia! Good, good, good. Another encirclement, you say? Yes! I mean? I'm joining with my uh, Kaiser cat, Binky. Glorious animal. Alright, where else? Probably push him out this way. The front up north is really, really bad. That's why I need more logistic companies up here. The supplies are just god 
terrible. Terrible. Let's grab this supply, though. Hit him even harder with better with better artillery. Nice. Nice. 1942. We could get better, even better artillery. Let's get some research speed. That's good. France is really disappointing in this game. Incredibly disappointing. I, they want to go to war with me, but they choose nothing. I even, you know, resumed from what the AI was doing. You bunch of crazies. Bunch of nuts, I say. Bunch of nuts. Cool. Great job, guys. Next, we'll probably move up here. So you guys come here. 2v2. We should do okay. Another two in divisions will get encircled and destroyed. They have less. Yeah, that's good. That's good. Good stuff. Another division. 9.3 thousand things of fuel every day. Still not enough. Three things still going. Awesome. Ooh. Got some radar if we really wanted to. To be kind of bold about that. That's okay. Let them starve. Help them out a little bit. Even though they really don't need it. Good. 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 Where else? We want to break over the river as fast as we possibly can. Good. 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 Two divisions here, huh? Hmm? No. Zertzen. I want Zertzen before we end this episode, though. Throw in another military factory here. If... Yeah, Newmark is ours. Moscow has long been ours, which is awesome. Let's see. How many divisions do we have for this? Right here, maybe? Right here, perhaps? Maybe. That's a definite maybe. Maybe not now. That's okay. Just try to break in there. Ah, it's our it's in. We just try to win now. We might be able to. They might have quite a few forts though. Eh, we might be able to win though. That'd be good. That'd be very good. Can you win here, perhaps? They don't have a lot of organization. They have some. Uh, you definitely should be able to win right there. As long as you. Oh, just go that way then. Ah, another division. Great. Throw them right here. On the western front. You guys might be able to win here, maybe? Good. Actually, air base. There's not too many air bases around here. Do that as well. Let's grab... Oh! Ottoman operative captured. We have ways of making you talk. Tarkhan? Huh. I can't believe the Ottomans want to invade us, too. What the heck? What the heck? I thought we were buddies! I wanted to help you! I even took on some of your debt! What's wrong with you? It's starts and is ours. Ah, oh, very nice. But that didn't really do very much for us. 74%. That's fine. We'll just keep pushing them back. Pushing them back. Smacking them down. Hmm. Saratov seems like a really good place to get. Now, I want you guys to come here. They calf you guys and come right there. We're going to circle two more divisions if we can. Or let's get down to here. Take up those guys. Very good. And come right there. Good. Very nice. Very nice. Keep the battle up for now. You'll be doing fine. I spy another encirclement around here, perhaps. Somewhere around there, maybe? Oh, we want this province so badly. I, at least I want this province really badly. What the hell are you doing? I just told you to do... No. 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 Stop. 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 I'm telling you to stop. Why don't you stop? The game has so much lag. Oh. Terrible, I know. Alright, let time go on. Good. Let's see if we can edit this just a little bit more. Heavy tanks. I want them all pretty darn heavy. Set this back a little bit, but that's fine. Whatever. Whatever. Because that's really just for the Western Front. We're getting invaded in Maghreb. Oh. That's not good. Actually, how is... Wow, this is disgusting. Australasian Confederation claims North Borneo. Pursuing a revanchist policy that calls it the Anderson Doctrine has laid a claim on North Borneo, no doubt, at the prompting of the White Raja, the man who used to run the Kingdom of Sarawak as his own personal playground and would like to see it restored. Whether that is true or whether the Australasian Confederation intends to press their claims or it is so, so much hot air it remains to be seen. Uh, I thought we had a non-aggression pact. 
I really did. Oh, we had an honor Griffin pact. So be it. Push him over the river. Is there oh, good. We got him. Boys, we got him. I know we're attacking tanks, and we don't want to have any, or really any anti-tank at all, but whatever. You guys come there. You guys also come there. Next up, we're going to attack that direction, too. Let's circle these four divisions if we can. Oh, we're going to need that guy right there. Good, good, good. You guys should finish off pretty easily. And turn you that way. A few... Oh, they, they're getting a few more divisions, perhaps. But once I can get more decryption done for the Russians, then another frontal attack should be good. Uh, Russians, Russians, Russians. I mean, they are 79% of the way there. Machine guns, good. good. Heart attack, piercing, good stuff, good stuff. Other research, land night assault, that's good stuff, good. Help support the attack. Nice. Complete the encirclement. Boom. Immediately march in. They look really weak, holy crud. Wish Poland and Lithuania would give me some of this territory. Let's see if we can ask for it. You guys, ask for control of state. Okay, games, please stop lagging like that. What the? No, give me. I wanted to click on this tile. I see Seratolf. Give me Seratolf. Good. Now I can actually build this area up a little bit more. More supply through here. More air bases. Oh, heck, I'm gonna go do radar because we can. But we need more refineries. Of course, more, 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 more refineries. Good, let's build up some more, some stuff in the United Baltic Duchy. The United German Duchy, I guess we should say. Good, another little segment complete. Is there anything else here? Preparing collaboration government as well still. Economic boom, right. Invest in Panzer factories. We get more heavy tank production for a year. Let's do that. With a little direction or directed investment, we could raise the productivity of our armor factories quite substantially. Some of our more conservative-minded generals are unlikely to approve of this, however, or this investment. But unfortunately, that's all the time for that we have today, my friends. Unfortunately, we were not able yet to crack the Russians. They're still pretty darn strong, but you know what? They're basically 80% of the way there. They're making a few more divisions, but we have been encircling their soldiers a little bit like crazy. But like I said, I hope you enjoyed today's episode. If you did, consider leaving a like. Subscribe, maybe if you're new. Check out my Discord link in the description below, and I'll see you all tomorrow as we attempt to continue cracking the Russians and smashing them beyond the Urals. Thanks for watching. Have a great rest of your day.